Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Lauren and in today's video I'm celebrating a very late Mother's Day with my mom and we're starting it off at Trader Joe's so before we get into it remember to like, comment, and subscribe because I want to get to a thousand subscribers for the summertime. But anyways, I need to go find what I need here so we can hurry up and get up out of here. Alright guys, so this is what I wanted from Trader Joe's, the cheese pastry rolls. I haven't had these in like two months I think. So I stocked up, I got six little boxes of them because I'm going to enjoy myself this week one way or another. Ooh, look at this, I want some tempura shrimp. Can I try it, Mom? What you mean try? All right, guys, so because this is my mom's late Mother's Day, she's talking about she's not gonna share the tempura shrimp with me, so I guess I'm just gonna have to wait till the next time we come to Trader Joe's to get some for myself because we don't have a whole bunch of space in our fridge left since we already went grocery freezer. shopping this week yeah freezer not fridge freezer since we already went grocery shopping this week so we can't really pack it up with more stuff so I guess I go without all right so we have finished at Trader Joe's it was really really quick we didn't need a whole bunch of stuff and I ended up buying the tempura shrimp for my mom since it's her late mother's day I was blackmailed into purchasing it um, but now we are, where are we going now? I, don't, I can't even remember. Oh, we're going to brunch. We are going to head over to brunch. We're going to another broken egg again because it's just the perfect place for brunch. All right, so we have made it to another broken egg and I am so excited to go in because I am hungry. I'm also super tired. I think it's because of like the weather. It's so gloomy outside today. So I've been like almost falling asleep in the car as we've been driving around all morning. But right now we are going to run in and hopefully they've got a booth ready because we're about to get some food. All right guys, so we were sat down. We did not get a booth this time. We're at a regular table, which sucks a little bit, but it's okay. Um, we're going to go ahead and look at the menu, but I'm just gonna order the same thing I always get. Um, if mom gets something different, then that is her prerogative because this is her mother's day. But yeah, we are in and we are going to order. So I'll see you guys most likely once the food gets here. All right, so here is our food. Mom ended up getting the peach bourbon pancakes. We got our shrimp and grits. And then I got my omelet and my French cinnamon bun French toast. Ooh, I'm excited. All right, guys, so this is what is left of our brunch. We are definitely taking home leftovers, but we thoroughly enjoyed our food. <laughs> this will be my dessert for the evening, so we're going to pack up our stuff, and we'll see you when we're back in the car. All right, guys, so we just got out of another broken egg. Oh, my we, gosh. Oh, that food was so good. I am Very good. stuffed. We have leftovers for later. I, pl I actually planned on after this getting a cupcake, y'all. I can't fit no more cupcake. I have a cinnamon bun for dessert. Oh, but my belly is full. My belly's full to capacity. Um, I got my pants dirty. If you guys see here, I got them dirty a little bit. Yep. So I got to find somewhere to wash that off. Uh, but other than How that, it's, dirty? it's like this little spot. Oh, the little spot. Um, we are going to go now because we're still looking for a center table for our living room. So we're going to go look for that. I want to go to Ulta Beauty. So we've got a couple more things to do today. So I'll see you guys once we get there because like, I need to recuperate after eating all that food. All right, guys. So we have made it to Ulta Beauty. Oh, my God. I swear I'm going to fall asleep again in the car. That's how full I am and how comfortable I am after today. Uh, but I'm looking for this Skin Tint Beauty Balm. I think it's Anastasia Beverly Hills. And I want to see if they have it there and if it'll like kind of match my shade and if I should even get it. So yeah, that's what we're mainly looking for. Oh, and some press-on nails too, so. Okay, so they didn't have my shade in Anastasia Beverly Hills, but I'm over here by the Fenty. And so I think I'm going to try these two in their skin tint 24 and 25 on the palm of my hand to see if that might work better for me okay so this is the fenty 24 in their easy drop skin tint and i'm gonna try to blend it to see if it looks good on the palm of my hand i don't know Lord only knows and i want to put it on my face just because I don't know what kind of contaminants are in it. Alright. So, I mean, it doesn't look bad. I mean, it looks like the top of my hand, really. 
all right so this is what it looks like on the back of my hand and i mean it doesn't look bad from what i can see heck it kind of blends in pretty good so hopefully that's a good sign i don't know if i'm gonna get it though because i've been burned before my foundation all right and so um i don't think i'm gonna get the skin tint foundation and i'm going with my mom right now to look at the lip glosses because she found a lip gloss that she's been looking for since forever um that she bought two years ago that got discontinued and i guess she found it again so it must be back and she is now leading me astray to find this lip gloss Yo, she found it in this brand Buxom. We have never purchased this brand before. Let me see what it is. 18% off. 18%. That's not 18% off. That is clinically shown to visibly <laughs> plump lips by 18%. I mean, it's a nice packaging, though. It's yeah, cute. Are you going to get any of the other ones here? Yeah, I wanted to get this. And which one was the one that I tried? It was like this? Or was it this? You said it was brownie, so it must have been this one or like this one. No, it wasn't that. It was something. All right, so apparently, get off me. <laughs> I'm buying the Buxom lip gloss because it's her late mother's day and she's just dancing. That one's just dancing her bones. All right, so we just left Ulta and I don't know how. I got absolutely nothing and this lady behind me purchased a 30 or had me purchase a 30 dollar lip gloss for her it came up to 30 dollars i don't know how i don't know how she found that for that price but her her reasoning is that it is mother's day so she deserves it so it i'm just my mother's day. it's her mother's day so i'm not going to argue i'm just going to sit back and be a good child yes and so now we are going to go into this is from what I see here. There's Ross, TJ Maxx, Home Goods, Marshalls, Kirkland's, and then that's it. We might not go into all those stores. We may. I don't know. It just depends. All right, we are in Ross now because Mom is looking to see if they have like any center tables in here, like I said earlier. And then I am over by the shoe section slash socks section because I need some more socks because I have walked out the life in my socks. So I need a find some new ones I found these they don't look bad at all but they feel a little too thick so I don't know oh no maybe not maybe not maybe they're not okay all right and then I have found these adidas socks they're not like long crew socks like I usually like I think that's what they're called those are the type of socks but um they're still they still have a little bit of a sleeve to it to go up the legs so I think these will be pretty good if I don't find anything else over here because everything else looks to be like, um, what are they called? Those really short socks that end like right under the ankle. I hate those because they always roll underneath my foot, underneath the heel of my foot. So if these are the only ones I find, I'm just going to get these two sets of socks and call it a day. Y'all, I found my mother in the mug aisle because I lost her for a little bit. And she says she found this ramen cup bowl because it reminded her of me. But I haven't eaten ramen in a minute. And then she found this E.T. mug. I'll be right here. All right, so now I'm waiting to pay, and so I've got my socks, and then I also found this cute little active top, and I need some more of them, so I'm going to get this one too. All right, guys, so we just got out of Ross, and we're going... Oh, Jesus, I just fell off the curb. Oh, oh my God. Oh, my little heart. Um, We just got out of Ross, and now we're looking to go into another store. We didn't... We didn't find an, a center table in Ross, and I figured we wouldn't. We have this other store here. I don't know what this store is. I'm not Chicken Little. Rude. This store is American Signature Furniture. And so, of course, you're going to find this expensive store to go into for me to buy this center table. But let's see. What would work? Okay, so here is one of the center tables we found. This is one of the first ones. Not bad. And then this is a couch, too. It's cute, but we already got a new couch. It's just cute. Like this couch is so cute. If we hadn't already purchased a couch, this would have been an easy contender for me because this is so nice. I don't know what it is about it. It just looks like smooth pebbles or rocks. This couch is nice too. Oh, wow. And look at how high the back is. And I like that center table, but it doesn't go with the silver. 
of our house, so it would be a no, unfortunately. All right, guys, so I think we've kind of seen everything we wanted to see in here. It's really nice. Don't get me wrong. The stuff in here is really nice, and it's really cool. Like, there was a couch that had wireless charging. That's how cool it was. But at the same time, it is super expensive in here. Like, insanely expensive. So we not get in anything in here suffice to say so we're about to head out i'm gonna look at a couple more things and then we're gonna be gone you guys look i found a bird's nest just hanging out of this tree right here it looks like it was made pretty well too darn all right, all right and we didn't find anything in that store we took like another 10 minutes to cruise around and look at stuff and we still didn't find anything like not even in the back and so now we're heading into tj maxx to see what they have in there and then i think we'll go into kirkland's and that'll be it for our center table extravaganza all right so we just came out of tj maxx home goods i didn't even film in there because there was nothing good in there to look at anyways my mom just ended up buying some weights for my brother to work out with here i'll show you guys one of them I'm not going to take it out of the bag, but she got like a 12 pound and a 10 pound weight. And so I'm going to wait for her to bring the car around because we parked far away and she realized she could not carry it all the way back there and neither could I. So I'm going to wait to be picked up and then we might go into Kirkland's. We might not. I don't know. It depends how all of this goes, but we might go into Kirkland's. Guys, we are in Kirkland's now, and when I tell you there is an aroma in the air, it's like a fruity aroma, but it's so overpowering. My head hurts. Mom is over there, there she is. She's looking at something on her phone, but she's gonna look around for the center table that they have here. And at some point when I feel ready enough to get up because of the smell that's hurting my head, I'll see if I find anything nice too. Alrighty guys, so I saw nothing of substance in Kirkland and I didn't even end up getting up because mom just came over and got me and said she didn't see anything she liked. So there was no point for me to get up. Now we are going to head over to this cupcake store I like called the Cupcakery because I'm going to pick up a few cupcakes and then we're going to head over to one of our friend's house. And then after that, we're probably going to like do the last little bit of errands that we have for the day. So I'll probably take you guys for that if I don't get tired and fall asleep in the car. So I will see you guys once we get to the cupcakery so I can show you guys these beautiful cupcakes. I might get one for myself, I might not. It depends if I'm like a glutton for pain today. All right guys, so we are heading into the cupcakery now. We ended up having to park at the back because I'm sure there was no parking in the front and I just did not have feel like having to deal with the parallel parking and all the traffic that's out today. So we are keeping it sweet and so all right y'all we came into the cupcakery and these are their cupcakes and this one is their cupcake of the month pop culture oh my goodness they are so good and then this is an up close of their cupcake of the month and then they have a cute little drink barista's choice the cosmo and wanda all righty guys and so we are finally at rooms to go outlet um will this be the last stop for looking at a center table today mom mm -hmm. Yep, today will, this will be the last stop. If we don't find something here, we're going to continue to look online. But this is their parking lots. Do, do, do. And so now we are heading in to rooms. To All right, guys. So there's this coffee table here, and I like it. The only thing is it's not absolute black. It's like a coffee black, kind of, if that makes sense. And then it's 237, and it's chipped up, and it's in store. I don't know about all that and you guys yesterday i went to ashley's um furniture store and they had a couch just like this there too and i loved that couch and they've got one just like it here but the one at ashley's was fluffier i don't know if that makes sense it was just fluffier i'll put a picture of it um if i can find it in my phone oh yeah and see i like this i like it but um, it's not as big as the one from Ashley's, I don't think, because the one at Ashley's, like I could put all of my feet, all of my um, weight and height on it, and my feet weren't dangling off like they are now. Like, see how my feet are dangling off? I was laying just like this, and my feet weren't doing that at the one at Ashley's, and that's why I want that one for the, my room, because, oh, it's just so soft and nice. Oh, my God. And then it has cup holders, like the one at Ashley's, too. Oh, my gosh. I really want a chair like this. I saw one on Amazon. It's an oversized um, chase chair or chassis chair. I don't know how you pronounce it, but 
I love this material and the feel of it. Ugh, I just want one as big as the one at Ashley's. And the one at Ashley's is like $1,099. All right, so I finally got off of that beautiful chair and I see this here and that's cute. It's just not in black, of course. And then there's this one as well, but I think it was already sold. It has a little sold sticker at the bottom, but it's cute nonetheless, but it's not big enough for our living room. And then this over here is cute but it's so darn it's sold too and it is nice but i doubt they have it in black if it's the only one on the floor and it's sold all right guys and so i found this glass center table and it is nice i'm surprised honestly how cute it is it's not black but it's still a nice silver the glass shines nice and it's 88.99 i mean shoot that's not bad i think it'll look nice in our living room all right, guys, so we just got out of rooms to go, kind of, because my mom wants to see if we can get the, because she ended up purchasing a mattress instead of a center table for my brother. And so she wants to see if she can get the mattress to fit in the back of the car. I don't know if it's going to fit. Hopefully it does, and we wouldn't have to pay for them to deliver it to our house. So, you know, fingers crossed that it does. So she's talking to the people now to see if, I guess, they can get it into the back. I don't know. So we'll see where all that goes because she's talking to him over there. If you see her, that's her right there in the purple. So we shall see. All right, guys. So we ended up fitting this mattress into the back of the car and we're taking it home now first before we go get dinner because we obviously can't see out of the back and that is a safety hazard. So we're going to go drop this home. My brothers will pull it into the house one way or another they're big and strong or whatever and then um <laughs> we're going to get dinner and most likely go to sweet hut after this we did not find a center table unfortunately the one we were looking at that i showed you guys it was nice but like the panel in the middle was missing so i think it was like defective yeah it was definitely defective. and that's why it was like 88.99 because all the other ones in there even though they were marked down they were still like 199 200 300 dollars so i was like yeah that's a little suspect but yeah we are heading home now because the street we are on is very dangerous and known for car crashes and i think we should at least be able to see before we start driving up and down the street so i'll see you guys once we take this bad boy home all right, guys, so this is actually the end of today's vlog. I know I said I would vlog at Sweet Hud or wherever we ended up afterwards, but you guys, by the time we got to the city, I was so zonked. I had no energy, and when we got to the city, there was no parking. I don't know what event was still going on this weekend, but you guys, it was just too much. I had literally had to hop out the car, run in, place my order, and then my mom had to come around the block to pick me back up, so I just was not feeling it. Um, but anyways, thanks so much for tuning in to mine and my mom's late mother's day extravaganza i will see you in the next video i am going to go meditate and um decide what i'm eating for dinner tonight so i'll see you guys in the next one bye guys